Hi, thank you for joining us at this video today. Just to let you know that all of our videos for this course will be available on this channel. But if you want the full experience, if you want the complete guide to music marketing and loads of PDFs about marketing in the music industry, then please enroll in our Udemy course as well. It supports us as well. It really supports us and helps us to really continue our work and to, to help you to succeed in the music industry. So if you want all this great stuff, please either subscribe to our YouTube channel, which I know some of you already have. So thank you very much indeed. It really does help. And also, please also just enroll in our Udemy course on our you on the Udemy. So uh, thank you for watching this video. Please like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell. Thank you. Welcome back to the course. And in this video, we're looking at competitor analysis. So do you know who your competitors are? Do they make similar music to you? How do they do it? Everybody who makes music makes music in a unique way. So your music will be popular because people want to listen to that way, that uniqueness in your music. That's why they listen to your music and that's why everybody listens to any artist or any band. So do they also provide you with marketing opportunities, your competitors? For instance, if you make synthwave music, you can promote it on YouTube because Synthwave has a big following on YouTube. If you advertise on YouTube, you can advertise on a Synthwave channel and people will find your music. And I think, yeah, I quite like that. I want to listen to it. So, so that's how you can promote your music on YouTube. So how many listeners do they get as well? Because, because before you start to advertise on YouTube, you are going to want to know exactly how many listeners the channel that you're advertising on gets you need to do a squat analysis as well in a squat analysis there is two columns and four rows rows one and three are split into strengths weaknesses opportunities and threats the strengths are what is the the strengths of your competitors what what do they do well what is their unique quality what is their unique selling point weaknesses is whether they need to improve where where can they improve where can can you exploit them and that is comes into your opportunities because everyone has weaknesses that you can exploit for your own advantage and then threats is where can this competitor gain opportunities that you're not taking to your advantage where can your competitor find a loophole in your business and take advantage of that for their own good. So over the next three videos, I'm going to show you some ways to do your market research. Tomorrow, we're going to be looking at Fedia, which is a questionnaire site where you can build questionnaires and gain insights from your audience. And then on the following video is going to be about Facebook insights. And then we're going to be looking at how else you can find market research online and gain an insight into what your audience thinks of your business and of your products and where can you find your loophole so thank you for watching this video and i'll talk to you in the next one where we're talking about feedia <music>